Hi, it's Dr. Kevin, author of The Hypothyroid Diet. Have you ever wondered why you still have hypothyroid symptoms even though you're being medicated and your test results look just fine? Well, the reason why you still may have hypothyroid symptoms is because of a condition called cellular resistance. This means that your cells are resisting the therapy that you may be taking or the hormone replacement therapy that you're taking, especially if you're taking a form of T4 or a drug called Synthroid. And there's a number of different medications. That's just one as an example. So what happens is you take this medication, which is all T4, which is a form of thyroid hormone. However, even though it's synthetic, it has to be converted to T3, which is the active form of thyroid hormone. And it's the hormone that makes the body go. So what happens is because it's not converting this and not getting into the cells, T4 is circulating in the bloodstream. And so your test results will look fine because T4 levels will be high, which will drive the TSH to a normal level or even low. It can even look as if you have hyperthyroidism. The other thing that happens is you may have T3 levels that are in the mid-range or low, but one indication, one thing that you can look at in a test result to determine maybe that you have cellular resistance or that thyroid hormone is not in the tissues is what we call reverse T3. If that's high, that's a good indication that you're not getting enough T3 or thyroid hormone into the cells to make you feel asymptomatic so you don't have the symptoms. And if you have your test results, I encourage you to get them from your physician and take a look at them. If you don't have the reverse T3 or some of these other numbers, make sure that your physician retests you for them. Um, the other thing that you can do is suggest your physician, hey, you know, I'm still not feeling great. Can we try a form of T3 or a combination of T4, T3 medication? And that should help. So hopefully this information wasn't too confusing to you. If you have a question, just put it below the video and I'd be more than happy to ask, answer that question for you. And if you need additional help or you want some more great free information, go to thehypothyroiddiet.com, register your email, and I'll send you a bunch of free training videos that will help you decipher what's going on with your thyroid condition. So again, hopefully this information has served you well. Until we speak again next time, eat well and be well.